Sport Dash from the Middle East, Sex Saturday, my city, Chicago, February the 24th, I do believe. 2024. Look, very short and sweet. When y'all didn't stand up for me, for real, for real, the ones who allegedly know me and stuff, barely you get a new sport of originated rap since AJ 1975, even if you did not know that about me. You understand what I'm saying? Because I personally didn't know when I was in Alcoholism and I went to in 1996. So, you know, I was just going through life and stuff, and I didn't realize how, you know, valuable I was. I knew I was worth a lot of money. I knew I was worth more dead than I am alive. You understand what I'm saying? You will hear that also in the movie Arlington Road. You understand what I'm saying? If you watch that movie, movie Arlington Road, he repeats it. And it came out after 1995. It came out like in 1998 or 1999. You understand what I'm saying? So, you know, you have to be careful of what you say around people because they use it against you and stuff. So for the ones who do know me, they know who I am for real. And that's why I wasn't talking all that, you know, what I'm talking now, you know, uh, originated rap and all that because I didn't realize my value and stuff. You understand what I'm saying? I was working so hard, I didn't have time enough to think. You understand what I'm saying? Now all I do is think because that's all I got time for. You understand what I'm saying? So for the ones out there, I always say it's not who you know, what you know. It's what you can prove and stuff. Now they was trying their best, trying to stop me to, you know, to go to that meeting uh, Saturday or whatever. And when I got off the uh, train on Howard, it was a white man and a white lady police. You understand what I'm saying? In the you know, in a car or whatever and stuff, looking like they wanted to start some trouble. So, you know, they didn't want me to go to the uh, speakerthon. So I stayed for a couple of uh, um, people or whatever at the speakerthon, but the, at the spirituality meeting, this lady named Lucky and who been knowing me forever, you understand what I'm saying, and Brian, who run the meeting, I have to break y'all anonymity because I found this book as soon as I left the uh, speakerthon, you know, around two o'clock or whatever last Saturday or whatever. You see what it say, Lucky? You see what it say, Brian, okay? So what you hear here, when you leave here, let it stay here and all that, they don't give a fuck about none of that. Everybody that walked through that room ain't trying to get sober, ain't trying to be your friend. And then they got all these migrants coming in and stuff for real, real talk. Stick with the rivers and the lakes that you're used to. Uh, real Mary McAmara's and stuff for real, real AA me. See, we going competing against each other and that's that's the downfall and stuff. That's how they able to infiltrate and all that and stuff. You understand what I'm saying? I personally don't compete because ain't no competition. If you're competing against yourself, like Cardi B said, you are competing against yourself, so y'all don't listen, and that's why y'all get the most time in prison, they say. You understand what I'm saying? Real talk. Look, I don't have to do this and stuff as much as y'all treated me like shit, but, you know, I don't want to see my people go out like a damn fool and shit, like... Uh, Martin Luther King said, y'all going to perish as fools. You understand what I'm saying? They got tens of millions of people and men, you know, coming into my city in America and all that and stuff. You understand what I'm saying? Weeping the benefits that we should have been weeping. So where are we going to go? Y'all letting the uh, Mexicans in the, in the um, meeting and stuff. And when they push us out, like Cat Williams say, where we going to go? You understand what I'm saying? They got a meeting down the street. They could go to that one. Why they all up in our business and stuff? That's all I'm trying to figure out and stuff. Real talk. We need to stay connected for real and put all the differences aside because uh, if not, that's going to be y'all downfall. Ain't going to be mine. I'm going to heaven. You understand? I ain't going. I'm going up. You understand? So that's what I have to say today and stuff for real, for real. Hopefully it won't be no bullshit, but you know I'm the originator of rap since the age of 8, 1975. I don't do this or talk for the fuck of it and shit. If you know this in AA before I got railroaded, May 31st, 2008 on Devon and Clark, like y'all was competing for my spot and stuff or whatever the fuck. You understand what I'm saying? I wasn't talking all this, you know, stuff like this and stuff. Why? Because I ain't feel it was necessary until motherfuckers came after me. And now, since they tried to kill me in 2016 and gave me cancer and stuff, and y'all walking around half dead and acting like ain't nothing wrong and stuff, y'all better start talking for real because closed mouths don't get fed real fucking talking. That movie Arlington Road. They thought that motherfucker was crazy until you opened up that goddamn trunk at the end and stuff and it blew up in their face. I am the bomb, motherfucker. Peace.